Earth as a close to star Jupiter-like gas giant planets generally consist of more or less uniform, closed, concentric shells of matter, layered according to density. The crust of the Earth, however, is an exception. Approximately 29% of the surface area of the Earth is composed of the portions of continents that presently lie above mean sea level. An additional 12% of the surface area of the Earth is composed of the continental margins, which are submerged to depths of no more than 2 km M.C. Len in 1991. The continental crust is less dense and different in composition than the remaining surface area which is composed of ocean floor basalt. To date there has been no adequate geophysical explanation to account for the formation of the non-contiguous, crustal continental rock layer, except the idea put forth in 1933 by Hilgenberg 1933, that in the distant past for an unknown reason or reasons the Earth had a smaller diameter and, consequently, had a smaller surface area. From modern surface area measurements, the smaller radius required would be about 64% of its current radius, which would yield a mean density for the Earth of 21 grams per centimeter 3. The reason for Earth's smaller radius, I submit, is that the Earth rained out from within a giant gaseous protoplanet and originally formed as the rock plus alloy kernel of a close to star giant gaseous planet like Jupiter Herndon 2004 b, 2004 c, 2006 b. The mass of protoplanetary Earth, calculated from solar abundance data Anders and Gervis 1989, lies in the range of about 275 to 305 times the mass of the present-day Earth. That mass is quite similar to Jupiter's mass, 318 Me. Pressures at the gas rock boundary within the interior of Jupiter are estimated to be in the range from 43 millibars to 60 millibars per dolmic and Cameron 1974, Stevenson and Sopater 1976. Such pressure in a terrestrial, Jovian-like gas envelope is sufficient to compress the protoplanetary alloy plus rock core that became the Earth to a mean density of about 21 grams per centimeter 3, a value virtually identical to that expected for a smaller Earth with a contiguous, closed, crustal continental shell. That identity, I submit, stands as evidence of the Earth having been a giant, gaseous planet like Jupiter Herndon 2004 b, 2004 c, 2006 b.